Thursday today and welcome to another episode of Ticket Thursdays and we are now on episode 3 and if you're new to this video you might want to check out episodes 1 and 2 for more real world IT tickets and if you are interested in this video please keep on watching and without further ado let's get started with the IT tickets and so let's get started with ticket number 1 hello I am reaching out seeking help with teams i cannot log in below is the error message i am receiving thank you okay so it is quite common for it people to encounter this kind of issues and tickets with users not able to sign in with different apps such as teams slack email so there are multiple ways that we can solve this issue and so the first thing that we ask the user to do is to sign out and sign back into the app they are having issues with. This is the easiest fix you could do with this and sometimes it works because sometimes they just need to reestablish their connection with the apps and just refresh their login and their credentials and it works most of the time. If signing out and signing back in doesn't work, most of the time, we try to narrow down the issue and we try to have them log into the web app. And if they're able to log in or sign in to the web app, most likely the software app is broken or need to be reinstalled. So that would be the next step for the solution. Reinstalling the app for software is one of the most common troubleshooting method that most IT people use because it saves them time to pin down what the issue is, what causes the issue, especially if the user needs to use the app or need to log into something urgently. It's very critical for them to be able to log in and you really can't pinpoint an actual cause or root cause for a problem. Reinstalling the app fixes a lot of problems most of the time. This is how to uninstall programs or software in Windows. So just open control panel through the search bar, for example. And if you don't have this view, you can go to the upper right and select large or small icons and select programs and features and it will show you the list of programs and you can just right click on that and it shows uninstall and that's how you uninstall programs and of course if all of those methods and steps didn't work to fix the issue google is always our friend and if there is an error message or error code it's very easy now to research and look for what the solution could be for example for this particular teams issue i was able to find the fix for this to fix microsoft teams error code CAA504B, delete the Teams folder from the local and roaming app folders. Then go to Windows settings and reconnect Teams account. Additionally, disable your VPN, antivirus, and firewall to ensure they're not blocking the login process. If all else fails and you've tried everything you could and you possibly know to fix the issue, Google is really a good resource to find fix for a lot of issues. So the next ticket is the ticket that I don't usually get. Uh, it's a Mac ticket and we are predominantly Windows based in our company. So we don't really deal with a lot of Mac uh, issues. Okay, ticket number two is upgrade Mac Pro 6.1 trash can style to Catalina. By the way, the trash can MacBook style is a really cool desktop computer if you haven't seen it it looks like this on the picture i actually want to take home one and at, when you see it at first it doesn't look like your average desktop pc and that's why it's called trash can because of the shape mac has more operating system of versions than windows and sometimes it's really hard to keep up with the latest because they keep releasing and launching very quickly compared to windows because windows launches a new os in such a long time but mac sometimes they release os within six months so it's sometimes it's hard to keep up with the latest os so 
you have to keep updating your system anyway for this ticket that i got the current os for this was high sierra and that was really an old os version and another team wanted us to upgrade it to catalina which is a newer software that will be compatible to the software that they will be using so that was the ticket and i'm gonna show you how i upgraded the os to the newer one okay i have a macbook here and usually go to this apple icon on the very top left and click on it and click about this mac and your current os would display and you can click on software update at the bottom and it will show the latest os that you can upgrade to so for the next ticket it's more like a project and this is a request for all of the machine in the company to be upgraded to windows 10 21h2 version in our company there's still a lot of computers that were still on the really old versions 1809 and 1909 which reached their end of life for 1809 was in may 2021 and for 1909 was in may 2022 these computers with the old version of os 1809 and 1909 will no longer receive security updates from windows because they reach end of life of course it's very important to install security updates and be up to date with the current updates because it prevents your machine from all of the malicious attacks especially for a computer that is on an enterprise network and for our last ticket for this episode i got a few offboarding requests for the terminated users and offboarding is one of the common tasks that i think people have to do offboarding means to remove and disable user accounts in all of the systems and networks and programs that your company has of course offboarding can be different from one company to another because every business has very different systems and software that they use but the main actions for offboarding are the following disable their ad account and move to termed folder or group archive their emails and data remove disable or delete accounts from all systems so that would be it for today's episode of ticket thursdays i apologize for the lighting today i hope you learned something from today's video and if you do have any questions please feel free to comment it down below and i hope to see you guys in the next episode of ticket thursdays thank you so much for watching